Link 2012. Approach this from multiple directions. I want to come back here later. Because we're not going to have anywhere near enough. Oh yeah, there's also stuff down here. Sneak attack! Not that it matters, the closer to your spawner I am, it's actually more dangerous. No strength right now makes it all the more difficult. Okay, let's go put away some stuff. We might actually go back. Why not? I mean, yeah, let's go home. <laughs> We've got so much stuff. And I want potions now. Because we got to deal with all this junk. And the middle yet. We still haven't touched the middle. Which is its own little nightmare. Oh, yeah, I can't one-hit kill them right now. No strength. That's not good. On the bright side, we cleared out a bit of this area. <laughs> Doc's right here. Makes our life easier. We haven't cleared it out completely, though. So what I'm wondering is, should we... How should we tackle this? Should we tackle it from going around that way, or should we tackle it from going around this way? I think it's going to be more exciting if we tackle it the way we're currently going. Alright, so let's get back home. Yeah, this chest plate's dead. We need to repair it. Harpoon gun's fine though, our sword's still at it. Our sword's taking a beating, man. Alright, right, please work, Mr. Teleporter. I don't remember how to fix it if it's not working. Alright, horses, please work. Nope. I'm under the impression that they're broken. I want to go see... We might need more light. I, I can't remember what all the... Uh... Oh, we need more chests here. Let's make some more chests. I just want to make two. Okay, perfect. Yeah, we have a lot of heads right now. Give me your backpack. Backpack's more extra inventory space than... Uh, sorry, it's more more extra ender chest space than inventory space. But once we unlock... Uh, what is it? Infinite backpacks. Then we'll have less trouble. Rich man's word. I almost put the backpack in the backpack. That would have been terrifying. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I can't remember. I think you get them in the last area, so it's still pain until then. All right, let's go back to... Let's go to the monument. Let's go place this head. Say we've defeated this area, even though we're not quite done with it yet. Head placed. Area defeated. Glitched. All right, let's go to residence. Put our. Why is that set missing? Uh, this isn't just me hallucinating, is it? The set's missing. I must have taken it. Oh! Did I use it in the. I can't remember if I used it for something. Must have. Okay. Oh, we have another set in here. We have a lot of sets. Alright. First things first, I need some blocks really badly. 
I don't want monster eggs. Why do we even why do we even have monster eggs in here? <laughs> Let's take some purple stained glass. That should do. Don't need that. We do need some more light. Let's go ahead and grab some more. We are almost sticking out. <laughs> We've been using so much light. That's kind of cool that we, we've used so much, but at the same time, it's also not so cool, so. Right, well, I don't think we got anything like that. We did get a lot of, oh, we got the, spe the special item, which normally costs us a fortune. Oh, I did wear it. So I wore it in order to go recover my stuff, remember? And we have a lot of sets. I'm surprised. And so few of them will ever be used. The time where these sets are useful is multiplayer. That's really what they're intended for. They're intended for a really cool mechanic on multiplayer. But sadly, I haven't played this on multiplayer. I might replay this some some year in the future. Multiplayer. Be fun. Wrong way. It's getting more expensive. 17 levels now. So we're going to have to ditch this chest plate soon and make a new one. That's okay, though. Food-wise, we need a little bit more. Don't need that much more, though. We're killing so much. We're good. We're all good. And we do have some potions in here. I'm going to keep those. Oh, one of these was for the recovery, which we never succeeded in using it for that. Okay, whatever. Comebacks bow. I'm going to keep it in here. I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to keep it at home for now. Where, where are the swords? These ones are switched. <laughs> That's annoying. We have strength potions. I don't think we have stamina potions. Oh well. Philosopher's potion. He's gonna take one of those. And what else do we need? Did we empty everything out? I don't think we emptied out all the XP yet. Alright. Yeah, look at that. Look at all of that. Good stuff that we that we can definitely use. Let's go back. I think we're set again. I love all of our unbreakable stuff. Very useful. You know, to be honest with you, these thorny leggings have probably saved us quite a few times. All right? Nope, he's not working. We're gonna have to game mode three for this. First of all, I want to check out Mister. What's his face? Skydelly. Jarvis. Okay. Okay, it's just XP bottles for, for light. And you can trade bones and whatnot for XP bottles. We don't have any of those. We don't have a lot of those, I suppose. We do have some. But... Oh, we could technically. Wee. Three. <laughs> yeah, we can't. I'm gonna get over here. And just as before. Oh, where's our ender chest? Oh, nuts. Is our ender chest down here? Yeah. Okay, we got that. We're not getting that. As much as I want it, we didn't find it on our own. 
Technically didn't find that ender chest either, but... It's okay. It's okay. Oh, we're gonna get another emerald here, aren't we? That's nice. We're gonna get another two emeralds here, actually. Bye. Hi, things. Bye, things. All right, let's go ahead and potion up. I'm not going to speed up or uh, haste up quite yet. I don't actually have a speed potion. I want to get down under what we just were at because that's also a hard area under here man these guys are lagging much more now I don't like it I want my game to be smooth and challenging So this little cove in here, I don't think it sported much in the actual uh, map, which was a bummer. Kale, what was this? Oh, it, wait, I think I remember now. This is called Kalem, right? I'm pretty sure this is called Kalem. That's the name of the map, with a C. All right, I, I, I bet money on that. Oh, sweet, another harpoon gun. Oh, this one's advanced, let's take it. Ah, basic ones, and eh, who cares if it's advanced? Ooh. Don't have any of those. Oh, come on, I switched pickaxe. By the time it took us to do that, a million things have spawned. <laughs> we made things worse. Thankfully, we can go under the water here, and the only thing that will attack us will be these urchins. Bonus now. Oh yeah, that's nuts over there. Oh, really nuts over here. I'm so nuts I don't want to be over there. Okay. I need to stop breaking the glass with my sword. <laughs> that's what's using up durability, I'll bet. Anything down here? No? Seriously? Okay. Whatever, ship. Whatever floats your boat. The ship almost seems stranded in here. It's it's it can barely I don't know if it can fit out. <laughs> it's funny. It's stuck in here. Oh wait, what's that up there? Let's... Okay. Get this first. It's a bunch of masts. I saw something over there. There's a spawner right there. Gives me the impression that something's up. Oh, I saw. Okay, this goes. This opens a little bit further. Interesting. Okay, we're gonna have to actually get up there in order to tell. Oh, we can't. I bet it's nothing. Hey, I was right. It's nothing. <laughs> Came all this way for nothing. And now our strength is running low. Oh, we still got four minutes, actually. Just harpoon gun everything up here. Okay, let's stop doing that. Throw it in here, just XP bottles. Fine with that.
no spawners down here. Uh, all oh, those weird, with some weird blocks. Oh yeah, okay. So here's the funny thing: the stone of the stone also had weird data values, and the weird data values on the stone were like one, two, etc. And then they decided in Minecraft, hey, we're gonna add different types of stone, which I never understood really. Um, and some of those types of stone <laughs> were the data values <laughs> that they uh, that they somehow had in the map. And as a result, I actually uh, there's actually some stone here that wouldn't have existed when they made the map. It's a weird paradox. All right, it doesn't look like there's anything else up there. There's plenty to be seen over there. I'm pretty sure these are just heads of mobs and stuff. I'm gonna take a zombie head. We don't. I'm not sure we have one. This chest shouldn't explode these, so let's go ahead and take it. Purple mist, a basic harpoon gun, and just some crazy paper. And we don't need basic. And we're probably gonna blow that up. Pretty sure that takes us out to somewhere. Right. For some reason, this is black and purple, like the errors. You can open these from the inside, but not the outside. Yeah, sneaky little entrance like this that you barely see. You're like, oh yeah, who cares about going in there? There's nothing. Well, there happens to be a doorway that leads out, so... Little W right here. Only I can get in this place. Oh, they might be able to get around. I'm not sure. Let's go check. Oh, they might they probably get in from this way. Yes, yeah, so they drop down. These guys aren't as scary when they're lagging. All right, and so we have, I'm, I, I'm sorry. And he's dead. And there's an emerald in a stack of XP bottles. How cool is that? But most importantly, we have the head of someone. Oh, golden. Yeah, golden. I love golden. I love all these people. <laughs> but yeah, Golden, you're... Oh, I remember Golden. Golden was, was an amazing moderator on Hypixel. Uh, they have it here for... I have it here for a reason, don't I? So I might as well... Place it down. Don't know why I have the TNT there. It's for a reason. That way we can get out and maybe go over there. That was literally it. <laughs> I suppose. Another way to a way to cut through here if you fall down from up there. Okay, now this is the moment that I really wish I had my flint and steel. Oh, great. I can't. I can't move. Oh, why are there so many of you? Why can't I hit you? Actually, I might go. I might go get the stinking flint and steel because I'm sick and tired of having to deal with all this. I want to burn it all down and move on. <laughs> okay. You're normally not supposed to be able to do this, but I did it. Haha. This is going to come in handy in the next areas, too. I think we're going to go to the other side, actually. We're going to go get the, the spawner. 
the crazy spawner with all the different effects on it. We're going to double check over here too for anything. Okay, the spawner up here. I don't see any chests, which is strange. Should be. Why would there be a spawner and no chest? It's just strange. Okay, oh well, let's continue. Be on our way. Oh, we could do this thing now. Yeah, let's do let's finish up this path. That we said we wouldn't earlier. It's probably nothing. Although there is this little hut. Isn't there something in here? I bet there is, I'm just not seeing it. Oh wait, under here? Under the steps? No, nope, nothing, nothing. Ah, here's something. Oh, we already got this. Um, I remember back in the day. This is just a funny story. It's nothing to do with the map. It's nothing to do with uh, descent. I, I, I was always in the map. I always wanted to make a really cool map. When I started out Minecraft, I didn't know anything. I didn't have any tools. I didn't have any mods. I, I, if I were to go back into Minecraft, I would probably use mods to make maps, to be honest with you. Because it's a pain to do normally. And I made this... And I, that, that, I think it was... Could you even fly on creative mode? No. There were no commands. So you couldn't fill in stuff. It was crazy. So I had this map I made. It was a parkour map. And I set it up to where there were XP bottles in different chests throughout it. If you looked really closely or you did just the right thing, you could get these chests that had XP bottles in them. And some of them were... I guess I'm just remembering. Some of them were pretty absurd how to get them. Um, like you'd have to be falling down something to open a chest in midair. You'd have to look between a crevice to find a button, then you'd have to look between another crevice to find a button, or you'd have to complete something super fast, or you'd have to exploit death, so you'd throw the XP bottles away, and then you'd die in order to get them back. It's weird. I remember that map, too. I had to fill in this giant like, 100 by 100 area of sand, because I wanted to make this sand, this sort of quest where you, like, you were in a desert. So I had to make one layer of blocks and one layer of sand. And that took me ages. It took me so stinking long. But I did it. Now, I never finished the map, I don't think. I think there was going to be a boss battle in the end. It was going to be super fun. But I never did. I just, uh, I guess I left it. Just probably found Hypixel. <laughs> oh, boy. And I mean, yeah, new stuff has come out since then. You have fill commands. You can do that all in just a few seconds. That took me hours. I used, I made a calcul. Oh, you know what we forgot? We forgot the the flint and steel. I got so caught up talking, I just put stuff away. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, it's so weird how far things have come. That a lot of these maps were entirely... I guess you had world edit back then. On servers. So that you could do stuff like that. The longest of times. Nope, you didn't. Wait, is there something down here? No, there's nothing. Okay. thought there might be. Sorry, skeleton. Oh, this, I bet this is a set. So it's actually probably good that we get it. Oh, never mind. That's the other chest over there. And we'll get it in due time. I remember loving all of Hypixel's maps. The Blaze boss fight. I don't think I could ever beat that one. I went back later, and of course I was able to. But back in the day, when things were... When I was a noob. <laughs> yes, we need the flint and steel. Let's grab it. Let's go. Perfect. That's what was on number four. 
flint and steel. It's been so different. And you know, I'm sitting here reminiscing about Minecraft 1.0. In Minecraft 1.8, when there's Minecraft 1.13, that most of you are probably playing right now. If you're playing Minecraft still, a fire resistance. Yep, called it. And it would be great to go back. <laughs> I've been tempted. I've been tempted to say, hey, I'm going to go do stuff. I, the one thing I wanted... Ah, maybe I have told you guys on camera about this. Considered going to 2B2T. Play that. Only issue is what I planned on doing. Helping to preserve things. And fight for creation. The... It turns out... That... They already have a thing where they keep, they have a, what's called the vault. So, any cool base creations, what they do is that they have a world download of it, and so then they transfer it all into, uh, into one world. And it's in the pinnacle of its state. That way, they can preserve it forever, which is really cool. It's crazy. I was looking the other day, I thought about this for a while. I thought, couldn't you create a hack that allows you to reverse engineer the location of something? So there's a seed, right? And the seed always generates the land the same in the particular version of Minecraft. So if you enter the version of Minecraft that something was generated in, and then you know all the blocks around it, you could theoretically find its position. Turns out they did that. <laughs> and so now nobody shares pictures of their bases because if it has any naturally generated land, you can use that. Now you don't even need the coordinates for that one. Just need the relative position of blocks. And while I think that's pretty cool, it's also pretty scary, you know? It's actually sort of neat. So pretend you forgot where your base was and you're a YouTuber and you recorded it. Well, you could have one of your fans go through and say, Oh, well, I have the program. Let me just uh, put in the relative position of the blocks in your base. And there you go. That's where it is. Find your way back. All right. This is... I don't know if I want to conquer this area. <laughs> and I meant, uh... Oh, you see this boy's crash, by the way? <laughs> Crashed into here. That's why it's all leaning to the side and doesn't have a chest. I think this is supposed to be the chest in it. Yeah, you see the little light right there? That's supposed to be on it, normally. Ouch. Let's actually go around and light everything up. Light everything on fire. Actually, no. Let's go... Let's get some torches before we do that. That way we can also place some torches. 